Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's lighting is a little whack because I'm actually in a parking garage and I have my car light on. So this is like all the light that I have right now, but it is currently Sunday, um, May 30th, and I just went on my first date in like five years. So yeah, that happened. Um, if you didn't see in the last um, vlog, I did update you guys that I have downloaded Bumble and Hinge. I am looking for a boyfriend. And this was like the first date that came out of it. And we just went and got coffee and like chatted for like an hour and a half. I feel like it went pretty well. He's like, he's like a tall redhead. I've never dated a redhead before, but he was cute. And I think it went well. Like I think I would go on like a dinner date with him. It wasn't like immediate sparks, but it was like fun. So I think I would go on another date, but I actually am sitting in my car because in 30 minutes I have another date scheduled in the same place. So yeah. Um, <laughs> We're gonna get crepes at um, the same like shopping area. So I'm just kind of like cooling down because it was hot outside and I was starting to sweat. So I'm like cooling down, calming down. I was a little shaky, but he was too, so it was cute. Um, but yeah, that's like, that's, that's all the updates I have for now. I'll let you guys know how the second date goes. And then I also have another one. Or do I have two tomorrow? I think I have two tomorrow. I have one for breakfast and one for coffee so yeah she's getting out there so we'll see we'll see how it goes but yeah that's all the updates that I have for now okay guys I'm back in the car after date number two and mm, that one didn't go as well the conversation wasn't really like flowing we weren't really like vibing I don't know I didn't really feel like um, we had a connection so I don't think I will be seeing the second date guy again. The first date guy, I would consider going like to dinner or like a picnic or something with him. So yeah, and then I have two more tomorrow, one for breakfast and one for coffee. So very excited. I think I'm gonna go home. I need to um, check on like all the ingredients I have for the week for like meal prepping um, and make sure that like my chicken is still not expired um, and that all my like lettuce is good and stuff like that. I was gonna make like balsamic chicken with strawberry grape salad so we'll see if my salad is still good and if my strawberries are still good and my chicken um and if not i might just go grocery shopping a little later but it's already like 5 20 i'll probably get home at like 5 40 a little bit before six um but yeah that is the update for sunday and i have tomorrow off so very excited um thank you to our veterans for your sacrifices made uh, for us to have Memorial Day to celebrate them. Um, but yeah, that is all the updates that I have for now and I'll see you guys later. Good morning guys. It is currently Monday, May 31st. It's 9.50 and I just got out the house because I have a breakfast date at 10 and the place is like behind me so I went and parked over here so I could vlog a little bit before going in and being early. Um, but yeah, today is another date. I had two yesterday and one went really well, so we're planning a second meeting. Um, and then this one today, it's Memorial Day, so happy Memorial Day. Um, and I have the day off, so I think after this I'm gonna go home and take a nap probably, unless I have coffee and then I'll, I might just be up. But um, I really need some water, I'm like parched. But yeah, uh, another date today. So these are my escapades uh, in the single life. Um, I hope that you guys don't mind all this stuff, but um, I'm just finally getting out there and it feels nice to like talk some to somebody, like talk to you guys about it. So um, I will be venting to you from now on. So I hope it's okay. I'm not gonna get into too de detail, too much detail about the guys specifically, um, but yeah, so having a um, breakfast date today and we'll see how it goes. Okay, I wanted to show you guys my outfit of the day because I think it's cute. It's like really simple. I tried not to be like too dressed up. I did a little like clip in my hair, pearl earrings, little pearl choker, and this like peptum top that's from Francesca's. Some like boot cut jeans with little sneakers. I just think it's like a cute little fit, right? I think it's cute. But yeah, just got back from the date today. 
And yeah, I think it went well. We like had a lot to talk about, which is really good. I don't know if like I'm gonna go on with another one with him. I'm not sure yet. I still haven't made up my mind. Um, so we'll see how that goes, but it was like really good conversation and stuff. So that was really nice, but I'm about to change and take a freaking nap because I feel so tired. I don't know what it is. Maybe cause I ate a lot or something. I don't know, but I'm like, I want to nap. <laughs> I really want to nap right now so I think I'm gonna go take a nap and then um, I really need to meal prep for the week so yeah but that's that's the update on the date okay hi guys I know I'm driving but I swear I'm being safe um, so today's Saturday and I haven't talked to you guys in a minute but I did go on a date on Thursday and it went really well and now I'm about to go on a second date with him today so very excited we're getting lunch slash brunch and there's like live music so very excited about that um I don't really have many updates for you guys I went to the dentist on Thursday as well and got my braces tightened again no big deal here but that's that's the update for today but I'll let you know how um how the day goes in the end and I wish I could have shown you guys my outfit because it's really cute today I'll try to get a shot in maybe I'll go to the bathroom or something. So I'll talk to you guys later. Hello guys, it's now Sunday and I have like bedhead, so excuse me. I haven't really like gotten ready or anything yet. It's just kind of like been a lazy Sunday so far for me. But I wanted to update you guys. Yesterday's date went really well. We spent like literally the entire day together and I'm seeing him again next week. So yeah, that was really exciting. And I did get a few things in the mail that I wanted to show you guys. So I have been using my AirPods at work and usually I'll only leave like one, these are AirPods Pro, sorry, but usually I only have like one earbud in at a time. So that way if like people need to come up to my desk and need me, I'll just like take the ear, ear pod, AirPod out of my ear and um, I'll usually like put it in my pocket for a little bit and then I'll put it back in my ear. Well, I forgot it in my pockets and I washed my jeans with the AirPod in there. They still worked, but they weren't like working properly, but I had like the insurance on them so I could get a replacement for like 30 bucks, which is fine. Cause they were like literally 200, 220, $250. I don't know. So I didn't have to buy like a whole new pair. So I finally got another, it was just the right one that wasn't working. So I finally got another one in and I like had to figure out how to pair it this morning, but it was easy. So that was good. Definitely recommend, um, I just love Bluetooth headphones. I don't know. I don't like wires anymore. And these are really good for runs because they have noise canceling um, software. So love those. And then I also got this um, new skincare product in the mail. This is from Polish Choice. It's the 2% BHA liquid exfoliant. I had been seeing this like all over the place and I really wanted to try Polish Choice. So I got like the mini version of it. And it's supposed to, it says unclog and shrink enlarged pores, smooths an even skin tone. I really got it for like this specific area right here. Um, and right here, last time, I am my chin actually, <laughs> last time I went for a um, facial, she recommended to use like BHAs, acids, um, some sort of exfoliant, not like a physical, ex physical exfoliant to get rid of this. And I had been using like a cranberry enzyme mask and an AHA toner. It helped a little bit, but really didn't do a lot. So I'm hoping that this will help kind of like solve this problem that really came from wearing masks for me and it's just like pretty much underneath my skin it's fine if I don't pick at it but if I pick at it then it ruptures and it turns into this kind of thing which is like a just a big cystic acne pimple um so yeah hoping that this will be my holy grail my saving grace I need to actually schedule another facial probably for this weekend that would be nice because I probably need to go back it's been like three months I think I think you're supposed to go like every six weeks. I don't know. It was like $200 though, <laughs> but it's a nice like pampering session. It was really relaxing. They do like the, the spa facial like mist, the warm mist on you. And it was, it was really nice. So I do want to go back, but yep, that's, that's it for the updates for this week. I really didn't do much. I'm like trying not to vlog on the dates, but we had like a really fun time. Like we did a bunch of stuff. Like we went and ate brunch at this place with like live music and they had like a whole, it was so cool. They had like a, like they bring out like a platter of a bunch of different types of food for brunch. It was really cool. 
and we had mimosas and then we went to the Museum of Fine Arts and then we met his friends at like a beer garden and then he made me dinner and we watched a movie so it was like really fun but I'm trying not to like vlog on the dates because it's like awkward you know what I mean but we did do a lot of stuff so like that was cool but yep I think that's all the updates that I have I need to like record a bunch of videos today um, because as you guys know SAS is coming up very soon and I need to have some stuff prepped for that I promised you guys a wish list which I'm still like making up my wish list today and I need to record my empties video and then um, probably gonna do another SAS video just because I think I want to do one like covering all the products that are gonna be at SAS um, I saw like self-care by Catherine did something similar to that and I want to try and do it um, just to kind of help me make my list my uh, wish list a little better so that's like the plan that's the plan for today um but anyways i'm gonna close off this vlog here i hope that you guys enjoyed it and i will see you all next time bye